you know, it has been amazing to see golf, obviously, in this quarantine, in this world, this crazy world that we're living in right now. But it has been amazing to see these players out there. And it kind of all started in a way of, you know, that that Brady, Manning, yeah. Phil, Tiger, that, that, was, that was really at the very beginning of back in May, I guess, not very beginning. But I, I thought it was pretty cruel that people were ripping on Brady, you know, for not having, you know, like he wasn't plus one or plus two, you know. I mean, giving. I thought, it was I, I thought it was great. I, I actually, I actually loved that they were ripping on him. Why I mean, is that? I they could have ripped on him a little more. <laughs> is that is that because of who you root for in the NFL? Uh, obviously, obviously. Well, you want to fill people in uh, for who may not know? I mean, so. Look, I have some AFC sort of issues, mental issues. You know, I have a schism, as it were, because yeah. I was born in Kansas City, Missouri, grew up there, you know, lived there for many years, and then moved to Denver, Colorado. So when the Broncos play the Chiefs, yes. I, yeah, I root for the Chiefs. Okay. I still root for the Chiefs. But actually, if anybody is playing against, you know, New England, I'm <laughs> pretty good them. <laughs> I don't care who it is. I, I don't, so now I don't know what to do with the whole Tampa Bay thing. I'm not, you know, I'm not sure where to go now. I feel kind of lost without a, a, an enemy. And without, without your North Star from New England for you to start rooting against them. I know, exactly. <laughs> Can I hate them both? Can I hate uh, him? Better sure, and you know. Well, I mean, there are, there are fans of Brady who feel that they have an AFC team and now an NFC team, so you could go the exact reverse. You can basically right. say that you have an AFC team you dislike and now an NFC team that you dislike. Yes, I, I prefer that. I you prefer could, the hater rate. You could go in that direction, Don. I mean, uh, <laughs> let, them come, let them come for you. What was that like to see the Chiefs win a, a Super Bowl then for you? Um, unbelievable. It actually, I was so, uh, I actually left. I was actually here when that happened. Mm -hmm. And I, I, when it wasn't looking good, I just, I walked away and I just went in. By myself, there was nobody on the golf course, of course, because everybody's watching the Super Bowl. Right. I just went and played a few holes and kept my phone off. So I was like, if they're going to lose, I don't want to know. Is that and, right? <laughs> yeah, I was like, I don't want to watch them lose. And if they win, I'm taping it. I'll just plug my ears and get home and watch it. But I can't watch them lose. Every playoff game was like, why are you guys doing this? Every playoff game, you have to be down 20, down 15, down 25. Why are you doing that? Just win. It was so hard to watch. Then the actual Super Bowl itself looked pretty bleak until. That's what until I'm saying. I'm out there playing. I'm like, I'm just going to go hit balls because I can't deal with it. My wife's like, you're not going to watch? I'm like, no, I'm not going to watch. Right. Please text me. I'm just going to go hit balls. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.